Maritime Deployment Day for thousands of local sailors. And this time, there's a twist. The main carrier of that group is not coming back. The ships of the USS Abraham Lincoln Strike Group headed out this afternoon. On the surface, it looks like any other deployment. Lots of hugs and kisses, goodbye. But for the carrier itself, a new home port is in its future. Depending your size, Deanna Bedena, she was there. Deanna. Well, I'm just outside the gates of Naval Station Norfolk, where the USS Abraham Lincoln took off just a few hours ago for its deployment. I spoke with some families who told me they already moved out to San Diego, but they flew back just to be here for this deployment. Sailors manned the rails as they took off on their deployment from Naval Station Norfolk. For many, it's their first deployment. Usually 60 70 percent is about a good number where, you know, you got first time deployers on board the ship. The USS Abraham Lincoln will be traveling around the world and then make a home port shift to San Diego. The ship is excited about getting back to California. That's uh, that's where its roots are and uh, and that's where we uh, we're looking forward to going. Captain Putnam Brown says families were given the heads up about the move in October. Megan Apple was in the crowd supporting her husband. She says she's already made the move out to San Diego, but flew back here today just for the deployment. It's been a lot and you have to grow up real fast, but uh, we're excited and we're really proud of him. Rear Admiral John Wade says there are a lot of young sailors on this deployment, but also veterans who mentor them. The average age in this carrier strike group is about 21, 22 years old. There's a lot of energy and excitement right now. And today was also a very special day. If you noticed in the video, the chiefs on the flight deck were wearing khakis instead of their dress blues, and that's because they were celebrating 126 years of chiefs being a rank in the Navy. Reporting live outside of Naval Station Norfolk, Deanna Betaneshi, 10 on your side. And the Lincoln has been in the area since March 2013 when it came to Hampton Roads for an overhaul. Meantime, we're getting another carrier at least into the shipyard. The USS John C. Stennis, which is based in Washington State and currently on deployment, will head here for refueling and an overhaul. The work will be done at Newport News Shipbuilding.